So it's so innocuous when I tell you, be like, this is a great program. But like in Texas, we get 66 cents on the dollar put into the Texas Treasury for every dollar of child support that's paid. Right? So the state is now highly incentivized to issue the maximum amount of child support. That's why they almost all divorces got 50-50 prior to the, the 1980s. And there was the skyrocketing of divorces where one parent loses custody. And that was to maximize Title IV D reimbursements to the states. In Texas, it's half a billion dollars to the Texas budget. If, if the, the state is profiting off of child support? Correct. And in most states, the judicial retirement fund is funded from this money. So the more child support that's issued from the family courts, the larger the judicial retirement. It's, and it's a massive program. It's the size of the largest defense programs. So the incentives are absolutely huge. To, in, to, to get people to pay child support? Correct, correct. And even married people, to get them to break up and then have to pay each other child support? Absolutely, absolutely, yeah. So because you would think the best child support would just be 50-50 custody and let people raise their kids. The best child support is to raise your own kid. That's yeah. the best child support. But they don't do that. Most states actually have laws prohibiting the courts from doing that. Texas has a, a, has a family code in which it's assumed to be in the child's best interest that one parent get 24% of the time. And the reason 24% was chosen precisely is it maximizes Title IV-D reimbursement to the state at 24%. <laughs> How, okay. How does it? Wow. How does the yes. maximization function? Yeah. How yeah. does it come out at twenty four percent? So it has to do with how the state calculates child support. So Texas has one of the worst child support systems in the state. It it doesn't take into account the income of both parents, and it doesn't take into a, account the amount of time you spend with the child. So there are, there are fathers out there with forty nine percent of the time that are paying maximal child support still. Wow. But it but again that maximizes the reimbursement to the state. I have a friend of mine. Him and his wife came to an agreement to do 50-50 parenting, no child support, because he watches the kids a lot while she travels for her work. And so it's all, it all worked out, and they decided it's just better to do it this way. The state of Texas sent an attorney to argue in the case that they should not be allowed to do 50-50 custody. I, I read a story about uh, some celebrity guy who had to pay massive child support, mm -hmm. and then he and the wife both went to the court together yep. as friends and said, hey, he's no longer working and doesn't have this money anymore, so we, we both agree it should be lower, and the court right. said no. They won't do it. Because they get, they get a cut. Is they get a huge is? kickback, yeah. Wow. Now, there's an even more evil program that's related to this Title IV-E. Title IV-E pays the states to adopt out orphans. What do you mean adopt out orphans? So like whenever, a whenever CPS takes a child from, uh -huh. from someone and then adopts them into a good family, they get Title IV E reimbursement funds, and it's a lot of money. It's like 50K per child. The state gets that money? Yes, it goes into the state budget. And where does it come from? Federal government. Interesting. Yep. So what will happen in Texas is some satellite office of CPS will get low on budget, and they'll go and find a white baby under two years of old, uh, years old, no, no uh, medical problems, from working class parents who can't afford a lawyer, and then they take the child and adopt it out, and then they get $50,000 for their budget. That's how they do it. Wow. There's massive incentives uh, to split up families in this country. And that's why you've had the explosion of divorce and rancor. So now you have the majority of children in America are being raised in fatherless homes. It's, it just, we well, passed 